<laughs> um, Are you okay? What was I doing? Oh, oh, I don't know. What happened to me? Oh, I don't know. I think. Yeah, yes, you know, it's because of the full moon. You know, some people are affected by the full moon. I mean, psychologically. Guys, do you agree with this idea that we are affected by the full moon? I mean, some people get more aggressive and they get less tolerant. According to some scientists, this is related to the quality of our sleep. If you get less sleep, you get more aggressive. And at the time of the full moon, we have some sleeping problems, according to some scientists. But this is not my problem because I am never, you know, aggressive, never less tolerant. I am always peaceful and I can welcome all the different ideas. The full moon cannot affect me. Nice yeah. Tea. Oh, can I tell yes, you, you know, you can, of course. Um, yesterday yes, you I was can. watching videos on your phone and suddenly I dropped your phone. Yeah. What did you do? And the screen is broken. What? <gasps> Mine, how did you do that? Please don't get angry with me. Yeah. Oh no. All right. The moon makes me angry. I'm sorry. Don't. I'm, I'm sorry, Dino. I'm really sorry. I didn't want to shout at you. I didn't like to think that I. Oh. Sorry, okay. I didn't want to yell at you. I'm also sorry. Don't judge me. It's because of the full moon. Yeah. You can judge it. Yeah, yes, you're yeah. right. And also, please don't put the blame on me. You can blame the gravity. It made it fall. Yes, you are right. Gravity. Yeah, gravity. Yes, gravity. On Earth, the gravity is such a strong force that it makes all the objects fall to the ground. Yes, but on the moon... There's no gravity. Oh, no, you're wrong, Dino. On the moon, mm. there is also gravity, but not as strong as in the Earth. The moon's gravity mm. is weaker than the Earth. That's why, you know, some people you know, the objects on the moon float. You might have seen them on some movies or on some yeah. videos. The astronauts are floating on the moon. They can't walk. There's gravity, but it's weaker. Mm. What do you know about the moon? Do you know? Oh, it's very bright. Yes, you are right. It's bright. Can I tell you something about this brightness of yes, the moon? Please. The moon doesn't have its own light. It gets the light from the sun during the day and at night it reflects the sunlight back to the earth. That's why we see it bright all the time in the sky at night. And also, you know wow. what? The moon is the nearest neighbor to us, which means we can see it with our bare eyes. That's why human beings have always been interested in the moon and they have always wanted to explore more about it because they, they can't resist the idea of exploring the moon and going there and, you know, finding new things happening on the moon. And once it happened, yeah, you know, you know who is it? No. Yeah. Neil Armstrong went to the moon. Wow. Yeah, he did it. So I think we can achieve this one more time. Why not? Yeah, yeah? so cool. And there's something else that I want to share with you about the moon as well. When you compare the Earth and the moon, hmm. which one is smaller? Mm, the moon? Of course, the moon is four times smaller than the Earth. Wow. That's interesting. 
although it is smaller, we can see it in the sky very well, but because it's, you know, very close to our planet. Seti? Yes, do you know? Why does the moon change its shape? Oh, wait a second. The moon doesn't change its shape. What? Really? I know, it's kind of confusing, isn't it? The moon doesn't change its shape, but we see it differently because of the movement of the moon. That's so interesting. You want to learn more about this? Oh yeah, yes, yes, of yes. Of course. That here is a video that I took yesterday to show you. Do you want to watch it? Yes, please. Here we go. In this model, the light represents the sun. The ball represents the moon. And my head represents the earth. As the moon orbits the earth, we see the different phases of the moon depending on the light it's reflecting to us. When it's new moon, we can't see the moon. However, it's always there. As the moon keeps orbiting, we begin to see a tiny part of it which is called as a crescent moon. The moon keeps orbiting and we can see more and more of it. The quarter moon and the gibbous moon. When we see the entire lighted half of the moon, that's the full moon. As the moon continues its orbit, we begin to see less and less of its lighted side. And almost 29 days later, we come back to the new moon. The circle restarts for another month. So cool! I think you understand it now. Mm -hmm. Yes. Here is something else. We call the month because of the moon. Mm -hmm. See? Moon. Month. That's interesting. Yeah. I know. <sighs> Dino and my friends, I think you are ready to answer my questions. I have a quiz for you. Quiz? Yes, a quiz. This is a surprise. So there will be some questions for you and you will answer all the questions in a short time. Can you do this? Yes, I can. I'm ready. Here we go. The first question. The moon is smaller than the sun. True or false? Hmm, let me think. Yes. It's true. Correct. Second question. Saturn is the nearest planet to the Earth. Oh no, it's the moon. Correct. The third question. The moon gives light to the sun. Mm. No, of course, the sun gives light to the moon. Correct. Fourth question. The moon completes its orbiting around the Earth in a year. In a year? No, in a month. False. Correct. The next question. The full moon is when we see the entire half of the moon. The full moon. Yes, true. Correct. And the last question. The gravity on the moon is weak. So yes, of course, this is true. Well done, Dino. You did a great job. Yay! Thank you, City. I learned a lot of things today. And the game was so much fun. I am the winner. See you later, guys. Enjoy watching the videos. Don't forget to give a like. Bye! <laughs> hey!